gorgeous it's your girl Saki Rosh and I'm bringing you an old video from my old YouTube channel to show you how to do a super easy super amateur lion or lioness look now first you're gonna need a foundation in the color of a lion which is like a yellowish tannish color you're gonna cover your whole face and your upper lip in that color now you're going to take a brown eyeshadow in a thin angled brush and use that dark brown eyeshadow to trace a line down your cupid's bow to separate the two halves of your upper lip. And you're also going to make that lip stand out by drawing a curved line down from the corner of your nostril down to the side of your mouth. You're going to do the same technique with your nose. Now, when you contour your nose, we're not doing beauty contouring in this case. So, you're going to make that contour wider than your nose. You're not trying to make your nose small. You want it to appear flat and wide, just like a lion's nose. And now, you're going to take a black liquid liner. And you're going to trace only the bottom half of your upper lip. Now the reason why you are not going to trace your whole entire lip with this color is because you need the top of your lip to appear to be puffy and standing out, just like a lion's lip, just like Homer Simpson. <laughs> and I'm adding whisker hose with my black liner by gently tapping it in the blink area. So our mouth appears to be fat, puffy, and lion-like. <laughs> and so now we have an eyeshadow brush, and I'm using a dandelion color to color my lips. This is totally optional um, if you've already painted your lids with the same paint you used on your face. So now you're going to use a pink color, and you're going to put that color on the bottom half of your nostril only the bottom half if you take your finger and put it across the bottom of your nostrils that's the only area you want to cover because you want to give off a square boxy lion nose not a round nose so you don't want to color your whole nose and then you're going to outline that pink area with a black liquid liner to make it pop and add a black line down or up the middle And I'm going to also use a pink color to color my bottom lip. With the black liner, you're going to trace your lids. Now, beware, I'm not doing a sexy, foxy cat eye here. Because this is, this is a tutorial that's supposed to be for men, women, children, anybody. We can do a sexy lion later. <laughs> Thumbs up if you want a sexy lion. But anyways, you're going to trace your lid and you're going to bring the inner corner down and further beyond your eyelid. You're trying to get a lion shaped eye. Which is shaped kind of like a lemon. A little bit. Now I'm taking my eyeshadow brush in a brown color to cover my eyebrows. And the reason why I'm doing this is because I'm trying to give the appearance that my brow protrudes ahead of my actual eyes. Because that's kind of how a lion's brow bone is. It comes before their eyes. And I'm using a dandelion color to highlight my nose to try to give it a more flat appearance and I'm also doing the same thing around my mouth I decided I'm gonna bring these frown lines down to my chin because I want that whole area to protrude outward like a lion now you finish it off with a big wig or in my case I had already had crocheted curls in 
you can add contact lenses to your eyes to add a little bit of flair to it um, I didn't do that and you can also add bangs if you like bangs and you want to make it more ferocious wait 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 girl wait <laughs> Before you exit out this video, I must let you know that I truly appreciate you tuning into this video. If you had a blast, you had a good time, let me know. Comment down below because it will motivate me to do more. Also, subscribe so you won't miss out on future videos like this. Also, feel free to let me know if you have any other ideas or any special requests. How about a sexy lion? Give me a thumbs up. Rate me if you'd like to see a sexy feminine lion or a tiger or anything that you want to see. Just let me know because I'm here for you. And until next time, I will see you later, and I hope you enjoy your day.